Did you know that the crocodiles we see today could have been dinosaurs in prehistoric times? It's a twist of nature that connects these two fearsome predators through a fascinating family tree. But before dinosaurs ruled the earth, there was a world more ancient and monstrous than you can imagine. It all dates back to what earth was like before the dinosaurs ruled from archosaurs. To huge flying insects, Earth was actually possessed by animals more monstrous than dinosaurs. So to find out exactly what the Earth looked like before dinosaurs, stay with us till the end to get a grasp of what existed before dinosaurs. At the beginning of Paleozoic era, Earth's continents were grouped together in a supercontinent known as Pangaea. This landmass configuration profoundly impacted global climates and ocean currents. One of the most significant events during this time was the Cambrian explosion, a rapid diversification of multicellular life. During this exploration, a wide array of complex organisms evolved, including the iconic trilobites, which were early arthropods, as well as various species of primitive fish in the oceans. Landscapes began to change as plants started to colonize the land. These early terrestrial plants laid the groundwork for terrestrial ecosystems and helped stabilize soil. The mid-Paleozoic saw the emergence of terrestrial arthropods like scorpions and millipeds. These were among the first animals to venture onto land. In the oceans, marine life continued to flourish. Creatures like crinoids and brachiopods dominated the sea floor. Ammonites, ancient relatives of modern day Nautilus, were common as well. As the late Paleozoic era progressed, Pangaea began to break apart. This separation of land masses had profound effects on both climate and biogeography. Amphibians with their ability to live both in water and on land emerged during this period. They were among the first vertebrates to make the transition from aquatic to terrestrial life. The skies were dominated by enormous insects like the Magnora and the Magnoropsis, which could have wingspans of up to 2.5 feet. These insects thrive in the oxygen-rich atmosphere of the time. In the oceans, various marine reptiles such as Ichthyosaurus and mammal-like reptiles known as Spalicosaurus become prominent. These creatures fill ecological niches in the seas and on land. This catastrophic event around 252 million years ago marked the end of Paleozoic era. It was the most severe mass extinction in Earth's history leading to the extinction of about 96% of marine species and a significant loss of terrestrial life. It's believed to have been caused by a combination of factors including volcanic activity, climate change and habitat disruption. The Paleozoic era, with its dynamic changes in climate, geography and life forms, provides a fascinating glimpse into the ancient history of our planet. It set the stage for the evolution of reptiles and eventually the rise of the dinosaurs in the subsequent Mesozoic era, shaping the Earth's ecosystems for millions of years to come.